What's going on guys Dylan here bringing you another Minecraft video first of all I just want to say thank you for all the support on this channel if you guys are new and like the videos make sure to subscribe it really does help me out a lot and let's also try to break like I don't know 2,000 likes on this video I think we could do that so yeah let's get it all right so yeah in the last episode we built this sick looking nether city well like we're starting to build it as you can see we have a couple staircases um and that's what's supposed to happen so let's see does he come over this yo I'm right here bro <laughs> like follow me yep <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's working. Easy. wonder how many times it takes before he, like, you know, dies. He's getting hurt quite a bit, though, man. And there he goes. Look at all the spiders. What is this about? All right, so obviously we got to add a little bit more lighting around here because this is not going to work. Um, but yeah, so today we are going to try to finish this or at least add another house, you know, extend the walkway. I'm kind of liking this block right here. So maybe we'll use this for like the actual floor instead of the grass here. Um, but yeah, so we're starting to build this and then we could add like some fences around here, some nether fences, something like that. I'm not real sure yet. And actually let's do this. So yeah, I don't know, maybe something like that. We'll just extend it on that side and then we could easily, hold on, let's extend this a uh, couple more blocks right here. There we go. So yeah, then we could easily just like put a fence right there and then we could just extend it all the way and then we could just have like a little fence going all the way around. I don't know, this might look pretty cool. I'm not real sure. I just want this part to be like really colorful and just like different because, you know, you don't see these blocks all the time and we always have the same kind of designs, you know, cobblestone, wood, wood, you know, just that kind of stuff. And then you look over there like that and boom, check it out. We got the whole nether thing there. We could even add some of these blocks into the nether building just to like spice it up, you know. But yeah, I'm really digging this now. This is looking good. I'm also going to add a little bit of planks to the walkway just because I think it definitely, you know, adds a nice look. If we just add some planks here and there like that definitely looks good and yeah man i'm i'm really liking this it's coming along we definitely just need to get a little bit more lighting here so we'll use these uh shroom lights but right now i want to start on another building or another house so we're going to extend this grass actually we don't even want grass we want this block so we'll just extend it out to like maybe i don't know pretty decent ways so yeah let's just start doing that we'll just go like this and all the way back here time to get rid of all of this all right there we go so i added a little bit more of the road it's all looking good check this out nice nice and so i think the way this house is actually going to face we're going to face it uh, this way, like the front door will be on this side. And then we could even have like a back door and then extend it over here. I don't know. And then this road could even connect back to the city. It's not even really a city, but I mean, we're going to try to make it like one. You know, we'll have like a bunch of stuff here. We could even do like another little shack for more villagers or something. We'll figure it out. Or maybe instead of doing another big house, what if we do like a couple little shacks like right here in this area? Like we could do one, two, three. I mean, that might be pretty nice. I say we do that instead. All right, it is time to start building. So let's go ahead and let's grab what blocks we need. We got a bunch of the warped stuff right here. Now let's grab, we need the red, you know? Um, all right, crimson stems. We got that. Got some crimson nylium. Got some stairs. Yeah, we got a bunch of stuff here. And then do we have any of the nether warp blocks? Oh yeah, right here. All right, so we got, yep. All right, nether warp blocks. There we go okay so we got everything we need look at this man this is coming along so like i said these are going to be small let's go with the warp stem on this one we'll start blue and then maybe we'll have a red roof so kind of like the opposite of this one and then we could do red windows also so yeah we're going to do this one like i said it's going to be small so yeah we're just going to do one of those little like three by three houses or not three by three i think it's a five by five actually see so yeah, i like that we'll just go up uh four blocks i think like that boom 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 nice yeah i'm really digging this color dude this is so nice because it matches like with the road and stuff and then obviously we need some planks so we'll just go ahead and do our normal little thing like this all the way around we're gonna need a little bit more wood don't quite have enough so it'll have three windows like this just enough room for like you know a bed and a villager that's it and then, like I said, we're going to use the red. So we got, you know, the stairs. We're going to go around just like this. Oh, look at that. That is nice. 
So yeah, we're just gonna do the full roof on this one where we just go stairs all the way around. Did not mean to do that. There we go. So yeah. I think this is gonna turn out pretty good though. And then for the top right here, I think on the inside, we're just gonna make it a plank because it doesn't need to be too tall on the inside. And then obviously for the looks, we're gonna go the full roof just like that. We got one last plank and then we'll have a slab here. So let me see if I can, yep. Go ahead and just make a couple slabs. Perfect. Last but not least, boom, there we go. And then, like I said, I want to add, you know, the shroom lights in here. So we're just going to put one right there. That's all we need. And actually, it might look better if we just have this one on the ground. So we'll just put that one there. Yeah, that's fine. All right. Time for the doors. Now, I haven't looked at these doors yet. So let's take a look at... And actually, I want to change this because this one is too much pink here with the door. So we're going to put the pink door or red, whatever you want to call this. Looks kind of pink on this house. And then we're going to put the blue door on this one. So let me grab a little bit more of this wood. There we go. Let's go ahead and make a couple more planks with that. This is about to look good. Check this out. I already know these doors are. Yep. Check this out. Boom. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's nice. So now all we need for this house is the red windows. So we're going to do that right now. But yeah, see, I like the little houses like this. You know, that's going to be good. Just to have a couple of these. I want to put one more right here, but it's just kind of crammed. Because look, we have this staircase right there. So we're going to have to like try to knock some of this off. If possible. And just make a little bit more room here. You got to keep the same theme, you know. You got to go all the way. So we're just going to do this. And there we go. Add a couple more. Now we're talking. Now we can put one more of these little ones right here. So we'll even extend the road uh, this way. All right, let me go grab some windows now. We're going to do the red or even magenta. I don't know. Should we do that? Whatever looks best. I don't know. I'm thinking red just because like, you know, these blocks are pretty, pretty dark. We just need some glass, which we have right here. Red dye is super easy to come by also. You guys already know what I'm talking about. If you don't, well, we used to have an iron farm. Don't know why this guy's out of here. <laughs> Thank you for the gold, my friend. But yeah, man, we used to have an iron farm over here with all the chests. Look at this. And this isn't even all of them. So we could just take a whole stack, make a whole stack of red dye. And now we're in business. Do we have a crafting table in here? I think we do. Yep. Wait. Oh, I thought the poppies were in here. Nope. Okay, so yeah, let's just make... Um, We don't need a lot, actually. We'll just make two stacks like that. Put the rest of the dye in there. The glass can go in there, too. Oh, wait. We got to make panes. I forgot. So yeah, we only need that much. All right, I am hoping this looks good. Hopefully it's, you know, close enough. Oh yeah, yep, we did it. We did it. Look at it, man, just take a look. That's nice, super nice. Okay, let's get started on this other one. Okay, for this house here, I think I'm just gonna kinda do it into the wall instead of having like where you can see all the way around it. I think we're just gonna build it like into the wall, but the same kind of idea and everything. Yeah, it's gonna be right here. I moved it back like another one. Uh, we're going to do the same thing, though. We're going to just go full warped stems. We're going to go the same idea as this one. Um, so, yeah, let's go ahead and do that. And then we still got those red doors. We're going to go ahead and throw that. Where is it? Am I blind? Is it in here? Oh, yeah, there they are. Okay, so the crimson doors. Definitely got to put one of those on this house. So, let's go ahead and do that. We're going to put a shroom light inside. And we're going to connect this right to the wall. We're going to have the windows on the sides, obviously. Got to do the same thing. And then, like I said, we're just going into the wall on this side. So we're just going to dig right here. Go ahead and put a wall like this. Perfect. And then now we just need a bunch of crimson stairs, which we have in our inventory right now. And we're just going to do the same thing we did right there. Just kind of extend it on this side. Upside down right there. Go like this. So, yeah, you guys get the idea. We're going to go upside down, regular upside down regular and then we're right in the middle so then we just do the same thing on this side and there you go place this here place your slab on top and that is how it's gonna look obviously we're just gonna extend it right to the wall same thing on this side then run the blocks here run the rest of your slabs and that's all we had wow that worked out amazing <laughs> And then obviously we'll extend this fence right here. So that way I don't just fall off, you know, we'll move the road over a little bit. It won't look so ugly, but yeah, check it out, man. Look at this. And then we got the red glass that we're going to put on the sides. And there we go. That house is finished as well. 
Now we just need to add the road that goes to it. And then the road will also go this way just to, you know, wrap back around over here somewhere. All right, guys, I am pretty much finished with the nether city. We're still going to add a couple more things, you know, here and there like always. But check it out, man. I don't care what anybody says. This thing is fire. So basically, I found a new lighting source. You know, I found a way to hide the lights. It looks so nice. So we start off. We got this nice little walkway. You come down. You got this. These trap doors are literally the best. Like you can see right through them. It looks good. So these are actually the crimson trap doors like for that wood. So that looks nice. We got the fence going all the way across. The only problem we have with the city right now is oh, wait, hold on. I don't know what's going on there. Okay. The only problem we have with the city right now is that once we put villagers in here, they're probably going to die because of the lava block. So, you know, we might have to remove those. But for now, we're going to leave it like this. It looks good. Um, don't need to get rid of a little bit of this grass. But yeah, so this comes up, kind of wraps around. Still got to do a little bit more of these blocks to make it look nice. But yeah, for the most part, we're looking good. So we got the first house. This is kind of the big one. We'll probably have, you know, a few villagers in here, something like that, that we can trade with. Keep going. We got two more houses here. So you got this one on the left, just a little one. In fact, really quickly, let me just throw crafting tables inside these. Just for now, you know, got to have something in here. Um, but yeah, nice designs on both of these. This kind of wraps around. Got the same block. This is just basalt on the ground. Hold on. Let me finish this. Don't watch, guys. I didn't finish. But yeah, so you can go around this even. You can come back here. And then I got fences. And there's just like a little staircase here with three little lamps. So I think it turned out really nice. I think we still should add a little road right here. Like we'll do some of the blue blocks going around and then connect it here. In fact, let me do that right now, actually. I think I should have already done that. There we go. Now we got it wrapping around to here. Everything looks good. But yeah, like I said, man, we're probably going to have to get rid of the lava blocks just because we're going to want to put villagers over here. So let me know what other blocks I could use for like a little outline. I don't really know, but I think this place is turning out nice. I've never done anything like this before. Um, so yeah, let me know what you guys think. But yeah, that is going to do it for today's episode. Hope you guys did enjoy. Like, look at that. Look behind me. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you're new. I'll catch you guys later. I'm out. Peace. <laughs>